Two men have been charged with murder and accessory to murder in the overdose deaths of two young women whose bodies were dumped outside of hospitals. Our Josh Haskell spoke to the husband of one of the victims and has this report. Jan Sillier, the husband of Christy Giles, who was dropped off at Southern California Hospital Culver City last November unconscious, is applauding the L.A. County District Attorney's Office for charging one of the men she met out while partying with murder. Multiple drugs were found in her system. Makes no sense that she's happy and healthy one day and then dead the next. Um, she, everybody operates in patterns of habit and nothing she had done up until that point in her life would have ever put her in that kind of danger. So something happened under the care of these people that caused her and Marcella to die. It's been over seven months since Giles, an aspiring model and aspiring architect, Hilda Marcella Cabrales Arzola overdosed and died. David Pierce has now been charged with their murder. He was originally arrested on suspicion of manslaughter. I realize that this will not bring any comfort necessarily to the Arzola family or the Giles family, but it will bring accountability. Pierce, who is 40 years old, also faces charges of sexual assault after additional women came forward following his arrest in the Giles Cabrales Arzola case. According to Gascon, Pierce faces a potential sentence of 128 years. We were looking for other victims, and we have seven additional victims that have come forward, and cases are being charged, and they date through a period of 13 years. Another man, Bran Osborne, who's 42 years old, has also been charged with accessory to their murders. In November of last year, Giles was dropped off at Southern California Hospital, Culver City, where she was pronounced dead. An autopsy showed she had cocaine, fentanyl, and GHB in her system. Cabrales Arzola was dropped at Kaiser Permanente, West LA, where she was on life support for 11 days before she died. Her autopsy found cocaine and MDMA in her system. The more people that can come forward, the better that you know, I think it's important for women to stand up for themselves and not let men get away with this, because if they do, then it's just going to happen again and again uh, with those guys when they think that they can can do this to women. David Pierce has a preliminary hearing scheduled for Monday, July 11th. In Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.